How you doing, Ron? Samson, how's everything going, bro? Everything's going well, man. Nice Are you excited about the show coming right up? <laughs> about to get excited? Yeah, man, I'm definitely excited. It's going to be one hell of a show. Two weeks out now? Yeah, yeah, two and a half weeks out. Yeah, I saw some pictures of you online. You're looking real good there. You're working with Milos, right? Thanks, man. We yeah. appreciate it. Well, let me go ahead and be the first to wish you the best of luck. I know you've been working training hard. Training hard. This your, what's your limit is this, is this for you? Oh, man. This is, I mean, this is my debut. So, for me, you know. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah, man. First time on there. So, for me, you well, know, I just want to make sure I bring my best into the show. Yeah, well, the best advice I can give you is go out there and have as much fun as possible and kick as much ass as you can. <laughs> yeah, I tend to do that. That's for sure. Yeah, but uh, yeah, I remember my first one. It was in uh, Helsinki, Finland, and uh, I was just probably excited as you are, you know, being my first time on there. Yeah. And uh, I couldn't wait to get on that stage and Get it on. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I mean, I think I feel like that right now. You know, it's been. How you, how you feeling right now? I mean, I'm excited. I'm really yeah. excited, man. You know, I think you probably know how it feels by like being your first one. But, you know, I've oh, definitely yeah. worked a hard, hard and for a long road to get here. So at yeah, this point, yeah. you know, I'm excited to get it on. I know I'm bringing my best to the stage. And, you know, I'm ready to show that, you know. Oh, OK. So uh, you'd be glad to, for the Olympia to be back in Vegas? or would you, Yeah, you, man. I mean, you know, like the dream is always to, when you want to do your first Olympia, it's always to be in the main ground, you know. So Vegas is definitely where it's at. You know, as much as it's cool when it was in Atlanta, you know, everybody is, uh, everybody is definitely, you know, Vegas is where it's home, isn't it? So definitely glad for yeah. you to be back there. Take it from me, somebody that's been there and done that. I don't think there's no better place to have the Mr. Olympia than Vegas. Yeah. I've competed in Atlanta, Helsinki, yeah. uh, California, LA. Uh, where else? Where else? There's one other place I can't think of right now. Oh, thank you. Where is it? Chicago. Oh, New York. New York. Yeah. New York. I like. I can't. I can't. I can't believe I'm forgetting the most important one. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, the, the the places they've had it have all been great. Yeah. But nothing in the world compares to Vegas. Yeah. It's oh, that's... it's the absolute perfect place to have. Just I think any kind of show, you know. Yeah. Because it's the you know capital of all, all shows. There's always something to do in Vegas. Always. Yeah. Oh, what was the what's the first thing great. you do after you finish the Olympia? After you get off stage. Huh. What's the first thing you like to do after after you finish the Olympia? I got a routine that I go to the room and eat pizza. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what I go plan. Uh, yeah, and then I leave there and go to McDonald's. Oh, Mac have hamburger. Oh. Oh, and then Mac I leave there and go to the strip club. <laughs> Dude, that sounds like one hell of a night. Yeah, that's a that's a plan right there. Yeah, and I I ended right there at the strip club. We always leave about seven in the morning because you know uh, seminar that morning. The oh, next so morning, that's like all night, all yeah. night. I don't, I don't get any sleep whatsoever. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, all right. I'm digging that. I'm digging that. Okay, you know what? Yeah, I think I got time for the night. Then I go and plan for a post Olympia. Then. Oh, okay, um, so uh, how has the prep been going so far? Ah, so far it's been hard, man. You know, Milos has definitely put me to the ringer. You know, yeah. he definitely wants me to bring my absolute best, you know, bring that 90s look back to the stage. So to say it's been a hard prep is an understatement. But you know what? You, you haven't had any setback or any injuries or nothing, have you? No, no, no. This is one thing that I got to be very glad for. I haven't had any injury in my career so far. So yeah. touch wood, it carries on that way. But, yeah, you know. You can avoid the injuries. It's always going to be a very good thing for you. Trust me on that. That's Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Major thing that you gotta avoid because injuries and bodybuilding have yeah. never got along at all. So yeah. how long have you been bodybuilding now? Uh, I've been doing it now for just over seven years, coming up to eight years now. So oh, yeah, I, you know, uh, well, <laughs> I'm a little bit different than most people. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I had only late, been so. I had only been competing about two years before I made my first Olympia. Oh, I started wow. in '90, and my first Olympia was '92. Oh, wow, that's fast. So it was, it was, I was a little bit fortunate, you know. When you got genetics, you know, yeah. things go a bit different for you. You know, yeah. every, everybody has their own path. You know, is what I'm trying to say. Oh yeah, 
So how, how do you expect to place it this year as Olympia? You know? Man, I keep saying, man, be my first one. I keep saying I just hope to crack the top 10, you know. But from there, it's basically as high as they can place me. Yeah, well, I, know yeah. I'm, I know I'm bringing my best to the show, you know. <laughs> After that is uh, in my call, right? So Yeah, yeah. So what, what placing would you uh, be happy with? Uh, legendary. I'm legendary. I'm legendary I'm taking the crown That's why I came Cause I came to reign Know the name Nothing can stop me I can't be contained I was born ready I'm legendary This is my legacy I made for this shit This is my moment I was born for this shit I make it rumble when I show my crown The time is now for you to build your own legacy, powered by Ronnie Coleman's signature series. I'm happy with you. you uh, know. First? <laughs> 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 I mean, I'll, I'll be, of course, his first one. Like I said, it's the first one now. So I definitely, if I, you know, especially given how big this lineup is, you know, with this many guys in it, definitely, you know, anywhere in that top 10, he's definitely got to be a positive, you know. Where have y'all been prepping at? Uh, because I'm here in the UK and we're just prepping, prepping right here in the UK. And Milo's just going to be looking over me over online and stuff. So, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, yeah. Uh, I think the, it, it, it ain't where you prep is. Uh, how you prep? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, that one is definitely first hand. You know, definitely that. What What, what do you think has been your uh, biggest sacrifice in the, in the sport? Man, uh, I think with this one is definitely time time with my family. You know, that is definitely yeah. been mental. The mentally has been a crazy mental battle. You know, it's something like a lot of guys don't speak about, but it's definitely been a crazy mental battle. Just so dealing with the struggles of it. And dealing with ups and downs or the mood swings and everything else. And no, I know all <laughs> about that. <laughs> yeah, so definitely so, had uh, all of that this prep. So have you always wanted to be a bodybuilder? Did you want to be no, something else? No, no, no. I was, I was a rugby player. You know, I was a rugby player all oh, okay. through my twenties. <laughs> and you know, I started bodybuilding at the age of twenty-nine, so I started late. You yeah, know? you kind of like me. Uh, yeah, I uh, football. You know, and, yep, you know, I was, yep. I was gonna be a professional football player, and that oh. didn't work out. So I, yep. I came to Dallas and got a job. And, you know, in my, <laughs> I got I got I got my degree in uh, accounting. Yeah. So I tried right. to find that, but uh, I never really wanted to be a bodybuilder. But God had other plans. <laughs> yeah, this is the same here. You know, I never really gave any thought of bodybuilding. You know, my lady told me, you know what. You got a good structure for it. You really should think about it. And I thought, man, I don't want to. I'm a grown man. I don't want to stand on stage in pants, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that ain't that ain't work. Yeah, Brian, Brian, was, Brian did that to me. <laughs> <laughs> he talked me into by giving me a free membership to the gym when I was very poor. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh man. <laughs> I did yeah, about good. anything was free, you know, especially, especially when it came to working out. Because working out has always been my hobby. Yeah. My whole entire life since I was 12 years old. All right. Yeah. Yeah, well, know. changes did you have to make in your diet, you know, this year? Anything different from last year? I mean, I mean, this year, I think, you know, where before for years, you know, I've kind of worked by myself, kind of getting myself in shape and stuff like that. But I think since last year, I started working with Milos, he yeah. sort of taken over that and sort of, you know, taught me a lot about, you know, not just how to diet, but how to do it properly and how to really suck down. I really sort of get into that conditioning part of the of things and everything else. So he sort of taught me that. And, you know, since I started working with him, we've seen change and everything sort of yeah. manipulated drastically, you know. And since then, we obviously we qualify for the Olympia. Well, um, How did you qualify for the Olympia? Uh, I won um, EVLS Prague last year. Oh, okay. You, you won that show? Yeah, yeah. Oh, congratulations on you. Uh, that thanks, was, did you thanks. first win? Yeah, that was my first pro win, yeah. Yeah. Milo, you worked with him at the time also? Yeah, I was working with him at the time when we got that win. And you then can't uh, find nobody better than Milo. That guy really knows his stuff. <laughs> he does know his stuff. On it, and he will get you ready. And he, 
Don't care how, yeah. how you know much you complain. <laughs> either his way or the highway, that's the way to go. You yeah. can't go wrong with him. Definitely, that is definitely Milo's strategy, man. He really does not give a damn how much you're suffering. He just he looks. No, like, no. Oh, we can do some more. Yeah, yeah, just a little bit more, a little bit more. Uh, so. Milo's has been through it. He 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 knows all about the suffering and yep. uh, all the hard work that goes into it. He's yep. done it, so he ain't gonna take it easy on you because. No. And he I, feels like if he can do it, you can do it. <laughs> yep, and you know what? That's why I trust him. You know, he's done it at this level. He's done it all himself. So he knows when he tells you, "Yeah, you got to do this, and you have to do that, and you yep. have to do this much." You know, he's done it himself. So you can trust him to say, "Okay, right. If he's done, I can do it." You do know? you have a training partner? Uh, I train with my girl, man. I train with my lady. I've always hey, trained you know, with my lady. Hey, <laughs> my girl was my best training partner. Ever. Yep, yep, and that's exactly it with me. I, I I trained with you know a few guys you know yeah they okay but no not the same girl, <laughs> not the same right he is yep. the best training partner <laughs> I've ever had she was yep. there every day on time every day yep. always trained hard had yep. a good attitude oh yeah Kept me uh, you know you know pretty much she you know she wasn't of course she wasn't trying to challenge me but but she, she was, was to keep you on track she keep was doing her track. thing and I was doing my thing yep in her own way. Oh yeah, and worked out for the best. So oh yeah, hey, I gotta give you props on that one. So, I know, man, I because I mean, she keeps me on track, man. She knows, she knows how hard I can go. So yeah, she yeah, knows exactly. when I'm backing off as well. So she knows exactly. I kick my ass and tell me, yeah, stop playing around. <laughs> you know? How long y'all been together now? Oh, we've been together for over eight years now. Oh yeah, she knows you real well. <laughs> yeah, man, yeah, because she got me into the sport herself, so she knows, and especially when she lives with me, so she knows I can't cheat on my diet because she makes sure she's on, she got an eye on me the whole time, so. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, how many uh, years do you see yourself competing in uh, Mr. Olympia? Man, as long as I can go. You know, I think Dex has all set a record for how long a guy can go. So, if I if I make it to fifty, because I start late, if I make it to fifty, I will gladly do that. If this body allows me to. I'm lucky I haven't had any injuries or anything like that. I haven't had any issues since I started yeah. the sport. Oh, so how tall are you? I keep going thing. until it, until I can't no more. Hey, who is your biggest competition that uh, you think at this show? Everybody. <laughs> I think it's you know what I always said. Yeah. My biggest competition was me because <laughs> exactly. I was always trying to top what I did, you know, the year before. Yeah. I never yeah, looked I at what anybody else was first doing. Olympia. No. And you kind of had that advantage when you the tra- the the reigning champion too. Yeah, <laughs> because all you got to do is beat whatever you brought last, right? Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> So I, I, I kind of that it might be the same for you too in, in in that aspect. Even even though, I mean, you're gonna have condition and you're gonna always try to you know be better. Yeah. That was pretty much all the questions I had for you. Yeah. Uh, you you you. Yeah, I would I would say like you know when you when you got your you got to your heaviest at the off season. What did you get up to and what did it feel like? I got up to three. I, I think it's on uh, it's on camera. It's on one of my videos. I think yeah. that was three thirty. <laughs> uh, because I, got to three, I got to 330 this past off season I'm 6 foot Oh I'm 5'11 so Alright so a few inches, but you, few inches. My, my, my 330 wasn't too bad Because I could still do splits at it you know? Oh man no I, <laughs> phew, Dude I was breaking everything I was breaking furniture I was I was definitely it was, how, how old are you right now? Uh, I'm tw- Well I'm 36 so yeah. okay, okay. Step it, I, my step body game up. really so peak until I got to around like thirty nine, forty. That, that, oh. That's that's my body really started peaking. Yeah. All but, right. So that's that's a good that's a good that's a good gauge then. That's a really I like that. I like that. So yeah, yeah. so I got another four years at least. <laughs> so I'm I'm liking that. So okay. And that so note, I, I, I competed on that Olympia stage for about six, seven times for one. Oh wow. Okay. 22. I won. Uh, my first Olympic was '92. I won in '98, so that's that's six years. Oh, you, oh, so six years before I actually won the first one. I like that. I see. But you know, everybody's body is different. You know, every yeah. era is different. You know, so you mean you you might do it soon. You 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 never know. Yeah. But uh, I, I can tell you one thing: you are on the right track. You look good. You're conditioning good. Oh, you thank you. One of the best trainers out there. Thank and you. hey, bro, I want I want to thank you uh, for taking the time to you know talk with me and do this little interview. And uh, like I said, uh, anytime you want to ask me anything, uh, 
Milo know how to get a hold of me, but I don't think you would need <laughs> yeah. anything from me, you know, because you got one of the best guys in the world training yeah. with you. But, you know, any any kind of, you know, life, life experience, I guess you want to ask Oh, about. yeah, definitely. Because uh, I had it I had it pretty good because my family was my biggest supporter. Yeah. You know, I used to tell people that the bodybuilding is not an individual sport. No, it's not. Yeah, we up there on that stage all by ourselves. But my mom cooked all my food. My sister did did all my fan mail and stuff. Yeah. My brother, he helped me with my cars and you know took took care of that. My sister cleaned my house, wow. <laughs> my washed house. my clothes. Wow. <laughs> so I had my whole family uh, helping me out. So bodybuilding is not an individual sport. You need a great mm-hmm. team behind you. Oh, hundred so, percent. Yeah. So hopefully you have that, and I think yeah. you have that. You're on your way to start them, my friend. Oh, thanks, man. Definitely, definitely. I, I think, you know, one day this Olympia thing is going to be wide open, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and with the physique you got, you got just as good a chance as, you know, any of, any, 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 any of the other guys out there. I appreciate it, man. Right appreciate now, it. I think Big Rami has, a, you know, a lead on everybody, but... Uh, that, that that that's not gonna last too long. <laughs> nah, you ain't, you ain't, you know. Yeah, definitely. Best <laughs> way the sport is going now. Now you never know. Uh, yeah. You are gonna have a a bad day. Anything can happen. I, oh yeah. Like, anything is possible. Anything can happen. Oh yeah, so, man, definitely. Good luck out there, and like I said, have fun and kick as much ass as you possibly can. <laughs> oh, definitely. <laughs> Go in there with a great attitude, and you'll do great. You'll do good, bro. Oh, thank Looking you. Looking real definitely. good. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much, man. Appreciate like it. Like I said, thanks for uh, talking to us. Thanks for coming on the show. And uh, like I said, if you ever have any questions, if you want to talk to me about anything, Milo know how to get in touch with me. But like I said, I don't think you will need anything from me. It seems <laughs> like you, you're on the right path. You're with the right guy. You got your girl, and I'm quite sure the rest of the family is right there with y'all. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, thanks. I appreciate it, definitely. Good, good luck. Like I said, Kick some ass and have some fun. <laughs> oh, we'll do. We'll do, man. Thanks very That's much. That's what it's all about. <laughs> Thanks, man. Dallas, anything you want to add? No, I'm anything? good. I'm Like I said, I'm just looking forward for all of us meeting up at the Olympia, seeing Samson in that first call out, and finally him getting to make his pro pro debut at the Olympia. I mean, it's just going to be so exciting. And uh, like I said, Ronnie, he really does have a good team behind him. So, yeah, can't wait. What day are you getting in there, uh, Samson? Uh, the 12th, Monday, the Monday 12th, yeah. just a week before the show. Yeah. yeah, I always went in around Tuesday, I think. Yeah. So yeah. I, I, I'll i be there uh, around Tuesday. Uh, oh, awesome. So I'm quite sure I'll see you around somewhere. <laughs> oh, definitely. Oh, definitely. Yeah.